Welcome to Mr. Caution TV. My name is Rick Rice, and with me is Tom Tom Lee. Uh, tonight, we're going to go over some uh, really interesting points on what's coming up with Mr. Caution, and one of them being his new project, which is the City of Bethlehem. That, and that painting is actually going to be the world's largest painting by professional Artist, for, exactly. For uh, um, the Guinness Book of World Records, right? Right, right. He already holds the world's longest painting. Uh, he also holds the world's longest drawing. Right. And then he also uh, <clears throat> has the world's largest uh, cardboard sculpture. Everything is more and better and bigger. There'll be, in the middle of the painting, there'll be an oasis. And then, which, you know, there's like a little pond, a little lake, or whatever. And uh, there'll be camels coming in from different sides. There'll be a, a star of David and a couple of the wise men, you know, in the, in the foreground. And also, they'll have uh, uh, their reflection coming up from the pond. You know, the, the blue, the color blue is a spiritual co uh, color. If that's what he is. Well, and it's comfortable, like the, the like the blue sky. You know, at the it's it's at the lower end of the visible light light spectrum um, uh, toward ultraviolet. So you know, it's real. It evokes a lot of calmness um, into into your um, unconscious mind. Anyway. Right. Yeah. Well, he channels his inspiration and incorporates symbolism as well as uh, uh, reality, like his concepts of sky and white white stars and birds and what have you, as well as the symbolism and, and, and those in, in those investigations and reflection. And so it sounds like a fascinating piece. I mean, it's just going to be so beautiful, so many levels. It'll be real interesting to see how this whole thing unfolds. And yeah, he works constantly. He's always right. creating. Um, like art is work and it's a lifestyle. So, you know, he embodies that for sure, particularly in this, uh, in this, this very, very big Oh, painting. I forgot. <laughs> Last year, he did the world's largest one-man uh, art show. Oh, yeah, 5, I read about that. 5,000 pieces, yeah. With him, he takes on a project that just develops into, it's going to be the biggest, but it always ends up there. This is a, another great project that we're going to be involved in, and we'll be bringing you more and more as we go along. You know, folks, thanks for stopping in. We'll see you next week. Remember, shoot with a camera, not a gun. Thank you.